today uh, we are we are studying about um, subsets what is a subset what is a subset let's consider subsets uh, if set a is equal to a b c d e f g set b is equal to a b and c is equal to c d and set d is equal to a b c um, and a, a, here b elements of one set b is in uh, in the set a a b c d e f g so we can uh, say that uh, set b is set set b is a subset of set a similarly set c is a subset of set a and so set d set d is a subset of set a but um, but um, a is not equal to b isn't it uh, then set uh, set uh, c set b is also a subset of d so the concept subset means uh, means uh, it is contained in set a if b if b is a subset of a then b is uh, named as uh, b is b is contained in set a set b is contained in set a set c is contained in set a set d is contained in set a set b is contained in set d understood here uh, there is a statement a is a, if a is a subset of b if a is an element of a um, implies that a is also an element of b a is a subset of b a belongs to small a belongs to a capital a um, implies that a belongs to small a belongs to small b uh, capital b what is that meaning what is then meant let's see what is that. set a is equal to 1 2 3 4 5 set b is equal to 1 2 3 4 5 and 6 then uh, set a is a subset of b isn't it 1 belongs to a means that um, 1 belongs to b i think you are, uh, you understood then what i mean, what i trying to tell if a is a subset of b then a contained in b one belongs to a means one belongs to b, b because b is the main set or power set uh, and here telling that here telling that uh, if uh, if a is equal to a b c d and b is equal to a b, again b d c implies that a is equal to b a is equal to b because that is a is a subset of b and b is a subset of a implies that a is equal to b 
that is given in this statement. And here saying phi uh, or null set or phi is an element is a subset of every set. Null set is a, is a subset of every set. That means phi has no elements. Uh, a, uh, is, if A is a subset of A, uh, that is phi has no elements. If, uh, let's consider phi and A and another set of A, B is A, then B is a subset of A and A is a subset of B. Let's um, Let's consider some points. Um, the, the set Q of rational numbers is a subset of set R of real numbers. Q is rational number and uh, indicating one uh, alphabet. R and the other is real number and indicating one alphabet. About Q is a uh, subset of R means that Q uh, rational numbers are a, is a subset of uh, real numbers. If A is a set of all devices of 56 and B the set of all prime de devices of 56, then B is a subset of A. We write B is a subset of A. Like this. Then, uh, if A is equal to 1, 3, 5, uh, or, um, and B is, is, X is an odd number less than 6, X, X such that X is an odd number, or natural number less than 6, then A subset of B and B subset of A, that means A is equal to B. Uh, in third point, in third point, A is equal to 1, 3, 5, isn't it? And B is an odd natural number less than 6. Again, it is a set of 1, 3, 5. That means A is a subset of B. B is a subset of A. That means A is equal to B. A is equal to B. If a is a subset of B and A is not equal to B. Then, uh, A is not equal to B. Then, A is a superset. So, um, um, B is a, is called a superset of A. Uh, a is a proper subset of B and B is called a superset of A. That is given in the uh, this uh, given in this point. Mm, let's ne, let's look at this. A is equal to one, two, and three, and B is equal to one, two, three, and four. Then A is a subset of B, but A is not equal to B and B is called uh, superset. And A is, is called uh, proper uh, subset. Subset of B. Let's consider some questions. Consider the sets. Phi A is equal to uh, Phi A is equal to 1, 3 B is equal to 1, 5, 9 C is equal to 1, 3, 5, 7, 9 Then Phi, below, phi is equal to uh, B Phi is a subset of every set And A A A and um, When we see uh, sets A and B and they are not equal. So, it they are not a subsets. Isn't it? Uh, a, while considering A and C. 
എയും സിയും നോക്കുകയാണെങ്കിൽ അത് സബ്സെറ്റ് ആണോ ഇസ് ദാറ്റ് സബ്സെറ്റ്സ് നോ ആ യെസ് യെസ് വൺ ത്രീ ഈസ് ബിലോങ്സ് ടു സി സോ ഇറ്റ് ഇസ് എ ദേ ആർ സബ്സെറ്റ്സ് ബിയും സിയും നോക്കുമ്പോഴോ വൺ ഫൈവ് നയൻ ദ ആർ സബ്സെറ്റ്സ് എക്സാമ്പിൾ ടെൻ എ ഇസ് ഈക്വൽ ടു എ ഐ യു യു ബി ഇസ് ഈക്വൽ ടു എ ടി സി ടി ഇസ് എ ഇസ് എ സബ്സെറ്റ് ഓഫ് ബി നോ വൈ എന്തുകൊണ്ടാണ് ഇസ് ബി ഇസ് ബി എ സബ്സെറ്റ് ഓഫ് എ നോ ബിയും സബ്സെറ്റ് അല്ല എൻ്റെ ലെറ്റ് എ ബി സി ബി ത്രീ സെറ്റ്സ് ഇഫ് എ ബിലോങ്സ് ടു ബി 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 സി സബ്സെറ്റ് ഓഫ് സി is it true that a subset of c if not given example ava example 10 nile parayunathu endana 10 nile parayunathu a ennu parayunathu a e i o u aan vowels aan b ennu parayunathu a b c d aan only a belongs to uh, in belongs in set b isn't it so they are not equal and they are not subsets in 11 we we are uh, they are saying that uh, the question says that uh, give some example uh, a b c are three sets a belongs to b b is a subset of c is it true that a is a subset of c uh, let's consider എ ബിലോങ്സ് ടു ബി എന്നാണ് പറയുന്നത് അല്ലേ അപ്പം എ ഇസ് ഈക്വൽ ടു വൺ ബി ഇസ് ഈക്വൽ ടു വൺ ടു സി ഇസ് ഈക്വൽ ടു വൺ ടു ത്രീ ഹിയർ എ ബിലോങ്സ് ടു ഡി ബി ഇസ് എ സബ്സെറ്റ് ഓഫ് സി ആൻഡ് എ ഇസ് എ സബ്സെറ്റ് ഓഫ് സി a is a subset of c mm. if not if not give an example ingane allengil adu or example aite tharanana parayunnu if this is the condition if this is the condition then a is a, a belongs to b b is a subset of c a is a subset of c and a is also belongs to sorry a is also uh, belongs to c if if the condition is like that a is a subset of a is a, is a equal to 1 b is equal to set 1 2 c is equal to set 1 2 and 3 then um b is a subset of c and um one belongs to a but one not belongs to c and one not belongs to uh, b therefore a is not a subset of c and uh, അതായത് ഇതിൽ പറയണത് എലമെൻ്റ് ഓഫ് എ സെറ്റ് ക്യാൻ നെവർ ബി എ സബ്സെറ്റ് ഓഫ് സി സബ്സെറ്റ് ഓഫ് ഇറ്റ് സെൽഫ് ഒരു എലമെൻറ്റ് സെറ്റിൻ്റെ ഒരു എലമെൻറ്റ് ഒരിക്കലും സബ്സെറ്റ് ആവില്ല എന്നാണ് പറയുന്നത് സബ്സെറ്റ് ഓഫ് ഇറ്റ് സെൽഫ് എന്നാണ് 